Welcome back to the Hot Tip Bets Daily Pick Show for Thursday, May 6th. Got another action-packed NBA slate. Um, not a huge slate tonight, but I do like two picks on today's card. So let's just get right into those picks. I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Game on the card, we got the Brooklyn Nets taking on the Dallas Mavericks. Nets come in as the seventh overall team in the hot tip at power rankings. Mavericks at 10. Both these teams have been pretty good seasons. Nets 43 and 23 on the year. Mavericks are 37 and 28. As far as injuries go for this game, no new injuries for the Nets to report in this one. Um, while the Mavericks will be without Christoph Porzingis and Max Kellerber. Um, now, as far as the Nets go, I've been kind of avoiding them the last few weeks here because it seems like every time I would bet the Nets, um, they would have, you know, some undisclosed injury come out and the dude would be sitting or they would just sit half their team. Um, but I feel pretty confident, again, looking at the Nets here. Um, the Nets are just one of the best teams in basketball right now, scoring 118.7 points per game, while the Mavericks only putting up 111.1. Um, and the Nets are winning their games by an average of 4.2 points per game. Mavericks, on the other hand, also on the positive side here, but only winning their games by an average of point or 2.1 points rather per game but where this Nets team really sticks out uh, is where it comes to shooting uh 38.9 percent from beyond the arc for this Nets team mavericks only hitting 36.1 from three um the Nets also do a really good job shooting free throws 80.7 from the free throw line you know if you've watched the show for any amount of time i love teams that can shoot over 80 percent um and the nets fit perfectly there um mavericks on the other hand only a 77.3 free throw percentage um the nets are just good shooting team they get all all around 57.2 effective field goal percentage for them mavericks a 54.9 effective field goal percentage um and the nets do a decent job scoring points in the paint too 49.2 you're not not the best in the world but is above the league average Mavericks only 44 points in the paint per game. Um, and I think that really helps them, you know, get those assists. 26.6 assists per game for the Nets. Mavericks don't share the ball nearly as well with only 22 and a half assists per game. Um, but when it comes to rebounding, um, it's another area where the Nets get the slight edge yet again. You know, 21.8 offensive rebounding percentage. The Mavericks real close behind them at 20.8 um, for nine offensive rebounds per game for the Mavericks and 9.1 for the Nets. Um, but the Nets do get a little bit further away here when it comes to defensive rebounds. 35.3 defensive rebounds per game for the Nets. Well, the Mavericks only pulling down 34.4 defensive rebounds per game. Um, the Nets also do a little bit better job stealing the basketball. 6.7 steals per game. Um, while the Mavericks only getting 6.2 steals per game. So um, this Nets team minus four here. Um, let's just knock on wood that no one sits out because every time I bet this Nets team, it seems like they just decide that half the team doesn't need to play tonight for whatever reason. So um, like the Nets minus four there against the Mavericks. And the second and final game on the card, we got the Washington Wizards taking on the Toronto Raptors. Wizards come into this 19th overall in the hot to pit power rankings. Rock Raptors right behind them at 20. Uh, neither of these teams have had the seasons that they've really wanted. We know Wizards 30 and 35 on the year. Raptors 27 and 39. Um, as far as injuries go for this game, Wizards will be without, without Rui Hashimura um, out with an illness, while the Raptors will be um, out without OG Anthony and Kyle Lowry, Yuta Walker, and Gary Trent Jr. all probable for tonight matchup. So um, have to wait and see their official status, but they will likely be playing tonight. Um, the Wizards have done a good job you know scoring points this year even you know he's being on the losing side of some of these games 115.8 points per game for this wizards team while the raptors only putting up 111.5 um and the wizards also do a good job just shooting the basketball you know 47.6 percent from the field while the raptors only 45 percent from the field um the raptors also have kind of struggled to get the ball down low only 43.2 points in the paint per game while the wizards do a really good job getting to the big guys down low you know um forcing points in the paint 52.4 points in the paint per game and i think that really helps this wizards assist total to 25.4 assists per game for this wizards team while the raptors on the other hand only 24.4 assists per game um you know the wizards just doing a really good job getting the ball around scoring some points there um and the wizards also do a good job rebounding the basketball 21.1 percent off the offensive glass for 9.5 offensive rebounds per game while the raptors only 20.7 percent off the offensive glass per 9.3 offensive rebounds per game but where this wizard seems really shines is on defense rebounding the basketball 35.4 rebounds per game off the defensive board while the raptors only pulling down 32.2 off the defensive board so um you know two 
comparable teams definitely um but i think the wizards do have the slight advantage definitely here um i like the wizards plus one and a half you can also take the money line if you want a little better odds there but um Official pick from me, Wizards plus one and a half for that game. That about wraps it up for today's show. If you want to see picks for all the NBA games going on tonight, head over to hottipbest.com and check out the computer model picks. Also got picks for the NHL and MLB up there, as well as some horse trading picks. And as always, the results for all of the games posted up on the website. If you're not already following me at hottipbets, Chris on Twitter and Instagram, make sure you follow me there. Also follow me on the Bet Stamp app to get early access to all my picks. Um, and make sure you're following the Hot Tibets main account on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok so you don't miss out on any of that content. And if you're watching this video here on YouTube, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification so you don't miss out on any future content. Uh, most importantly, drop a comment down below. Let me know who you guys are betting on tonight, and I will see you guys tomorrow. <laughs>